yesterday. Yesterday I thought this, <laughs> that's a beautiful, beautiful jackhammer, jackhammer thing. Or whatever that is. I don't think it's a jackhammer, it doesn't matter. Yesterday I thought this might be a sign of life for the Doomsday payphone, that big red splotch of graffiti that used to be here is gone. And while I'm no advocate of graffiti, I, I always thought this was, this was one instance where graffiti just worked. Because right under the words, graffiti is a crime, you have this big splotch of blood red graffiti and there's still a little bit of it left. But I thought this was a sign of life with the phone. I thought it might have signaled that the owner of the phone had come out here. And cleaned it up and then I imagine further that he took care of the phone itself but that's not doesn't appear to be the case my guess is the, the graffiti and the, the enclosure were actually cleaned up by the owner of this beautiful strip mall isn't it beautiful? I'm guessing either the owner of this place cleaned this thing up or, you know, you hear, I read about volunteer cores of people who band together to clean up graffiti in the neighborhood and that kind of thing. Maybe it was that. Whatever the case, I, I really don't think the owner of this phone would bother if he had let that graffiti sit there for years and years. I just randomly come out and clean it up without doing anything for the phone itself. What is that anyway? Something to do with the tires. That shows how much I know about cars. Anyway, I thought there might be a sign of hope for this phone when I saw the graffiti was all cleaned off, but dreams are dashed yet again.